Welcome to PC Whiskid's Tech Talk. Today I wanted to go through the Evolution Mail in Ubuntu. Let's set up through the um, screens here and launch the Evolution Setup Assistant. When you go through it, just put in your name and your email address of the account that you want to set this up for. In my case, it's going to be my Gmail account. So I'll just put in my pcwizkid.tech.talk at gmail.com. In your case, you would put in your own email address of the account that you want to set up and click on forward to move to the next screen. The server type for the incoming mail server is a pop account, so we specify the pop account name. In this case, for Gmail, they specify that it's pop.gmail.com. So put that in there and then put in your username for your account. And after you type that in, select the SSL encryption as the secure connection type and then check off remember password so you don't have to keep putting it in every time it synchronizes. Now on the next screen we want to specify the incoming uh, options and I want to leave the message on the server so that way uh, I can always go back in case uh, I deleted it from my uh, local copy here. And for the outgoing mail server we'll specify the SMTP server name which is smtp.gmail.com and then of course it's using authentication as well so we'll just have to check off that security option to uh, enable SSL encryption and don't forget to check off the remember password option here at the bottom and then we'll click on forward to move over to the next screen which has the uh, time zone setting so we want to specify the area that you're in and I'm in the uh, Eastern Standard Time area so I'll just select that zone and then move over to the forward button once it's set up, we can launch the Evolution Mail, and it's pretty standard. The interface looks like the Mac OS Mail or with the Outlook Mail or any other mail program. It's pretty much a standard setup. When you go to send and receive, it'll ask for the password, and then put in your password to access your account. And once that's in there, it'll synchronize with the server and download. And you can see it downloaded 31 messages in my case. And that's it. That's how we set up the uh, Evolution Mail. I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.